Hello viewers, today I am going to show you how you will make fresh mewa or khoya at home. It is an easy process but very lengthy. You just need little patience. Here I am using a packet of 1 liter milk with medium fat. Put the flame always in low. While making mewa, you need to keep stirring so that it cannot stick at the bottom. Mewa or khoya is useful to make any kind of sweet. Sometimes where we live, it is not always available fresh mewa. So the alternative option is making at home. After stirring long time, about an hour, now you can see the concentration. Need to keep stirring. Okay, the, the challenging part is this one now. Um, you need to keep always stirring and uh, after the, the, the mixture becomes uh, hard, it starts to become a little more sticky and gel-like, you need to keep stirring um, until there is no liquid, liquid at all. You will feel that you need to scrape the bottom of the pan uh, or the bottom of your vessel not to um, allow it to stick, okay? It's, you always look for the parts where it starts to stick and you scrape, scrape, scrape until all the liquid evaporates. You should be able to see the bottom of the pan and no flow of liquid when it is finished. It's really a, a work of, of uh, persistence. Keep scraping on the bottom. It's really scrape, scrape, scrape. Not allow it to, to burn. Scrape all the areas. And you start seeing the bottom. It's really almost. Liquid is still flowing, but it has to be fully, sol fully solid. Don't forget to scrape the outside, not to allow anything to burn on the wall. There it goes. So approximately one liter of milk will come like a only the bottom of the pan really see it's like a dough when it is finished it really takes a lot of effort so don't give up keep stirring and stirring and stirring it will come like this see no liquid at all let it cool down before using. After it cools down, notice how it even holds the spoon and doesn't let it fall. If you like this video, as always, don't forget to drop us a like, subscribe to the channel and if you have any suggestions of improvements for our uh, cooking, please make sure to uh, give a comment down below.